Hello everybody, I'm Dr. Ahmed Al Malak from Hail Health Cluster, Hail Dental Center. Uh, this video is done in cooperation between uh, the Hail Health Cluster and the General uh, Directorate of Infection Prevention and Control. Uh, and our topic for today is uh, the, the water quality in dental clinics. We will start about the uh, daily and weekly disinfectants that used for the uh, drainage water system. We have to dilute the disinfectant uh, based on the manufacturer instructions. Then we will perform suction to disinfect the water lines. This procedure must be done at the end of the day and at the end of the week. At the end of the day, we have to remove any remnants from the spit-on filter and discard it in the black bags. Or uh, if you have amalgam remnants, you have to discard it in an amalgam container. Also, at the end of the day, you have to clean the suction filter uh, to avoid blockage of the drain system and you have to follow the manufacturer instruction for proper cleaning procedure for dental clinics that has independent water source which is a, a bottle filled by distilled water we must do proper cleaning and disinfection using uh, approved disinfectant for water lines at least once per week we have to do a proper cleaning for the bottle and you handle it aseptically then you must purge the disinfectant from all the uh, dental unit outlets to do proper disinfection of the water lines at the end fill the bottle only with water then purge from the outlet from the dental units to remove any remnants of the disinfectant for water bacterial sampling it must be done at least every six months and it's the responsibility of the public health inspector in your facility the sample must be taken aseptically to avoid contamination of the container. It must be taken from different areas like the main container and the CSSD and different clinic at each time. Flushing from 20 to 30 seconds of the hand piece after each patient very important procedure to reduce the backflow of uh, the, any microbes to the water line system. Also flushing for several minutes at the beginning of the day is very important procedure to reduce any bacterial load at the water line system. Thank you for your listening.